Maui. Maui. Yeah, we were listening to we were listening to Moana. Ma yeah, we'll have Maui on again in a minute. <laughs> oh, it's okay. I'm sorry. We just can't listen to him while we're vlogging. <laughs> yeah. No, Ma. Can I do your snap? Can no. I fix, fix your snap? Uh, good morning. It is Thursday and it's about 10 to 8. We're just waiting for the babysitter to get here. Um, sitting on the floor playing with some of Penny's toys. Hi. Hi. She, she got up late today because of the whole nap situation yesterday. So she still got some bed head. Uh, yes, yeah, so I have babysitter again today from 8 to 12. So um, uh, as soon as she gets here, I will head upstairs and do some work. Um, yeah, we're just hanging out until then. Can you say hi? What do you have? What is that? Hey. It's a brush. It's a brush. Yeah, mommy's old brush. Mommy's old makeup brush. Hey. Hi. Mommy. Oh yeah, we'll put Maui on again in a minute. This is what she does when she's upset. <laughs> she lays down. Oh girl, I know, I know it. All right, it's about 8.15. I am up in the studio. I've just been recording an announcement um, that I think will have already been published as a video on YouTube and hopefully on Instagram as well. Um, I mentioned in yesterday's vlog that my um, my class, uh, Pay With Me Pastry, won the Best in Show for Skillshare's Summer Contest. Um, and as a part of the prize, they've given me a year of premium membership to give away to somebody. So uh, you may have already watched the announcement video, but I'll say it here again because it, that can never hurt. Um, and so what I'm doing, um, in, different than other times where I've just like straight up done a giveaway, like a drawing, I really want to make sure that the prize is going to go to somebody who will use it and really get the most out of it. So the two ways to enter are to uh, enroll in my class. And of course I'll have the link in the description box and, uh, paint an illustration, paint a painting, an illustration of your favorite pastry and upload it to the class project section. And the second way, um, because I know not everybody can access the Skillshare class or is able to take it whether it's for time or because they don't have a, a Skillshare membership or whatever um, then the, the other way to enter is to just do the same thing paint your favorite pastry and upload it on Instagram with the hashtag paint with me pastry and the deadline to enter is August 31st midnight August 31st and I'll just be choosing basically like my favorite illustration from everything that is submitted so and that person will get the the free um, year of Skillshare premium um, and then for the rest of today I need to uh, send in that sketch um, for the private commission. Um, I need to prep some Etsy orders. Um, I think I'll probably also do some other Skillshare planning or maybe some more um, Inktober <laughs> prepping. I'm having a lot of fun with these little um, round illustrations that I'm doing. I showed some of it in yesterday's vlog, I think, but because I wanna limit myself to 30 minutes, I basically just like, so I've done the illustration and then on the back, I put a little post-it note that said um, how long I spent on it so far. So this one I've, I've spent 10 minutes on. So I can still spend up to another 20 minutes adding little details with like colored pencil and stuff. I was going to try to do it without any colored pencil, just with marker. But I don't know. I can't escape it. I love colored pencil too much. So they're probably going to be a mix of, um, of pen, uh, ink, and colored pencil, and maybe some gouache. We'll see, but they are going to be limited at 30 minutes and they're all going to be round. And uh, yeah, I'm really excited about it. It's fun to work on a project with like this kind of really specific constraint. I've never done that before. So uh, yeah, um, I did not plan on working on them so much yesterday, but I ended up doing that um, anyway. So, all right, I'm going to get to it.
well. So I have 15 more minutes before I have to go downstairs and take over uh, with Penelope for a little bit. Um, so I did end up working some more on the Inktober paintings uh, or illustrations. I am just having so much fun with those and it's really nice. I've been just like, working on uh, so many really involved and in-depth and um, more complicated projects over the last few weeks so it's just really nice to be doing something that's quick and loose and um, I'm getting to the stage where the experimentation feels a bit more fun and is not so like uh, unnerving or self-conscious feeling so uh, yeah I did end up spending a bit more time doing that and then I uh, was on the computer um, and posting the announcement about the Skillshare contest and um, what else was I doing? Uploading more footage. I always forget that. I'm like, why don't I vlog more? It's like, it takes no time. It takes like two seconds to check in and set up the camera. And then I remember it's because of the editing. <laughs> so vlogging is awesome because it is, the vlogging itself is very quick, but the editing takes forever. And I wanna try to get the first one up tomorrow since this is a series. And I've mentioned that the first one would be up on Saturday, no, Friday, and today is Thursday. So that means I need to get that uploaded. So um, I was starting that process. I probably will finish that while Penelope's on her nap. And right now what I'm doing, uh, I'm just going to flip you around here so you can see. I'm getting ready to package up uh, a couple of Etsy orders. So I've got my washi tape and some of my packaging materials. I'm going to flip the camera down so you guys can see what I'm doing. Um, anyway, it was kind of a light week in terms of retail stuff. So I just have two orders. I have, um, let me show you what I'm putting in the different containers. Um, this one is a couple different postcard and sticker packs. So... Um, I think I call this one the dessert aesthetic. So it's this guy, this guy, this, this, and two stickers, a strawberry. And these are the vinyl stickers that work like on laptops or water bottles or whatever. Um, strawberry and ice cream. And then the other pack is the ramen. I am all turned around. Ramen and milkshake. Uh, strawberry and pretzel and these ones I call the the comfort food uh, the comfort food pack and this one has again the ice cream sticker and a grilled cheese sticker so since they're both going to the same person I'm going to put them in the same um, in the same baggie just because I like to try to save materials where I can and just try to minimize the amount of packaging um, and these are five by seven baggies, which let me put more things in them. Um, if it was a four by six perfectly, I would only be able to fit like one of these postcards. So doing a five by seven is helpful. All right. Oh, whoops. And I forgot to put that in. I'll just put it on the outside and I just kind of fold this down and tape it. And I pretty much always include a little thank you postcard, so I'm just going to write a quick note. All right, and then I'll just put this into this envelope here. I'll address that off camera. <laughs> And then this one um, was my avocado print. This was pretty cool. This was just a friend of a friend contacted me because they saw the print up, I think, in my friend's house and then wanted one too. So I'm going to pop the business card in the back here and then seal it up. And after I'm done with these, um, with these plastic sleeves, I want to get some of the biodegradable ones. I had unfortunately bought like really big containers of these um, a while back, so I'm still working my way through those, and then I'll get the biodegradable ones. And then I like to use, again, a little bit of washi tape to stick it to a sheet of chipboard. I used to use two 
um, two of these pieces, but I really don't think it's needed. Like the, the mailers I use are very, very rigid. Um, so the combination of the rigid mailer with this, I think is more than enough and I haven't, haven't had any complaints. So I just like to keep it minimal where I can. So there it is. And I'll pop that in. And then again, another little thank you note. This one is All right, and for this one, I will probably print out a shipping label from the Etsy website. Uh, this one, I'll just use stamps because it's kind of fun. <laughs> okay, so I am going to read an email that just came through, a uh, work email that just came through, and then I'm going to head downstairs and do lunch with Penelope just based off of how yesterday went when I tried to put her down earlier and she would not go down. I don't want that to happen today because uh, I definitely have some work I need to get done while she's napping. So um, I think I probably will eat lunch with her and then hang out with her until like 12.45 or so and then try to put her down around then and then hopefully I'll get two hours in and then uh, we'll go to the gym when she gets up. Uh -huh. No. No. <laughs> no. No. No, you can't have the camera. No. No. The camera. <laughs> no, 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 no. No, 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 no. Should we no. get some food? No. You don't want any food? What should we have for lunch? Oh. You gonna open it? Open. Uh, open. How about we do some beans? Or you can have some avocado. Cucumber. cucumber cucumber yeah we have to cut it we have to cut it first yeah you can hold the cucumber you hold the cucumber yep it's the same thing as a pickle it is what do you say yeah thank you we're gonna have some of this all right the babysitter said that penny actually had a lot to eat already so she may not have much uh, much of this for lunch, but I'm having some ground turkey and black beans with a big pile of shredded cabbage and um, with cabbage salad with bell peppers and Penny added her little cucumber here on the side. So we are gonna sit down and eat. Carly. Someone has been asking for Hello. you. Look who it is. Who is that? Papa? No, Papa's not there. Papa. She's been saying Carly nonstop. <laughs> <laughs> what are you guys up to today? Um, babysitter just left a little bit ago. Huh? I was working huh? this morning. I don't think you really do want another one. I think you just are asking for one. Huh? We'll have more later. Let me go get a towel and clean you up. Um, yeah. so we just ate lunch, um, yeah, you're sticky, you're sticky. That was a nice kiss. What are you doing? Well, somebody has reached the silly stage of tiredness. It's about 10 to 1, so I'm going to bring her upstairs and put her down for her nap and then come back down and do some more work. Can you say night-night? Can you say night-night? Night-night. <laughs> night-night. It's just before three. I've just been sitting here on the couch for the last almost two hours. Excuse me, I've been, um, have I just been editing the vlog this whole time? Or did I do something else? I might have just been editing the vlog this whole time. Um, I shot way more footage than I thought. I had to cut out a bunch of stuff and it's already still going to be 35 minutes long. Um, so this will be the first in the series. You guys are going to see it tomorrow, um, but it was my Tuesday. So I'm hoping that um, Wednesday, yesterday, and today I have not recorded quite as much footage. Um, but anyway, Penny's going to be up any minute now. When she gets up, we're going to load up and head to the gym. Um, and overall, it's been a pretty good day. I've gotten about six hours of work in so far. Um, Hopefully I'll be able to do at least a little bit more tonight. Um, and yeah, that is the plan. It is 
about 5 40. um i just got back from the gym a little bit ago eric is downstairs with penelope um watching slideshows of herself which is one of her favorite pastimes i'm gonna hop in the shower and then um finish making dinner or put penelope down all the rest of the evening stuff so i think i'm gonna end today's vlog here i will also be vlogging tomorrow and i haven't decided yet whether i'm gonna try to vlog on saturday or not um we'll see it's a possibility um but yeah that's it for today thank you for watching and i will see you tomorrow